Welcome to our channel. Sports cars deliver a level of driving entertainment that's inspiring to enthusiasts like us. Traditional needs, such as fuel economy, cargo space, and in some instances, rear seats, take second fiddle to driver engagement and grin-inducing acceleration and handling. Today, we're diving into the future of speed with the top 10 new sports cars of 2024. Get ready to have your adrenaline pumping and your heart racing as we explore these incredible machines. Number 10. Mercedes-Benz AMG SL Class. The 2024 Mercedes-AMG SL Class blends luxury and performance in a head-turning open-top package. The current generation SL leans more heavily toward the performance side of the spectrum, but still threads the luxury needle well enough to appeal to its traditional clientele. The latest SL also made a departure from the recent past by expanding its cockpit from a strictly two-seat configuration to a 2 plus 2. The rear seats, though, are far more suitable for stowing a briefcase or handbag than for transporting even pint-sized humans. The glitzy interior features a large central touchscreen, the angle of which can be adjusted to reduce sun glare. The SL is capped by a power soft top that, when lowered, eats up less trunk space than the previous model's retractable hardtop. Mercedes-AMG offers a trio of powertrains, starting with a turbocharged four-cylinder in the SL43, stepping up to a powerful V8 in the SL55 and graduating to a stonker of a V8 in the SL63. Number 9. Nissan GTR. Although it's been updated yet again, the Nissan GTR is basically still the same R35 generation coupe that began hitting dealer lots 15 years ago and quickly earned the nickname Godzilla. This year sees the return of the mid tier T spec model, which slots between the premium and full blown Nismo versions. The twin turbocharged 3.8 liter V6 engine still makes 600 horsepower under the hood of Nismo units, while premium and T spec models see a tamer yet still potent 565 ponies. The usual performance bits are still present, too, including E-adjustable Bilstein dampers and Brembo brakes with carbon ceramic setups for the performance-focused variants. The same dual-clutch automatic transmission and grippy all-wheel drive system are present, and they work together to provide the blistering acceleration that the GTR has come to be known for. We're not sure how much longer this generation of the iconic nameplate will remain in production, and those who decide to buy a new one will surely appreciate the still monstrous capability of Godzilla. Number 8. BMW 8 Series. Large Grand Touring 2 doors are a rarity in today's automotive world, making the 2024 BMW 8 Series coupe and convertible that much more valuable. Each brings a particularly elegant look along with a balanced driving demeanor. While not as quick as the automaker's M8 models, reviewed separately, the 8 Series still offers plenty of power with either the standard turbocharged inline 6 or the optional twin-turbo V8 under the hood. Inside, both models pamper occupants with high-end materials, comfortable seats, and plenty of space to stretch out, at least in the front seats, the rears will be snug for anyone of above-average height. But there's more room in the back of the 8 Series than two of its key competitors, the Mercedes-AMG SL Class and the Lexus LC, both of which offer barely their chairs. Plus, if you truly need a full-size cabin, BMW offers the mechanically similar 8 Series Grand Coupe with four doors and more room inside. Number 7. Ford Mustang. For more than 55 years, the Ford Mustang has continued to evolve into a more sophisticated steed. This iteration comes standard with a 310 horsepower turbocharged inline 4 EcoBoost engine with a 6 speed manual transmission. And while the pony car gets as wild as the 760 horsepower Shelby GT500, reviewed separately, the more conventional choice is the Mustang GT with the 450 horsepower V8 engine. 
Both the four-cylinder and V8 can be mated to a manual transmission or a 10-speed automatic. Mustangs are offered either as a hardshell coupe or ragtop convertible, but every Mustang powers the rear wheels. Although a high-performance 330-horsepower EcoBoost is an available upgrade for the four-cylinder, the Mustang is best served with the growling V8. While its closest muscular rival, the Chevy Camaro, has a more ergonomic interior, the Mustang's larger back seat and better outward visibility make it easier to live with. Number 6. Chevrolet Camaro ZL1 The Chevrolet Camaro ZL1 walks the thin line that separates where the everyday meets the racetrack. Using the everyday Camaro, reviewed separately, as a building block, the tornado that is the ZL1 makes the mighty 455 horsepower Camaro LT1 and SS trims feel like comparative wind gusts. Credit the ZL1's trim exclusive 650 horsepower supercharged V8, as well as its wide Goodyear F1 supercar tires that are as sticky as S Mores. An available 1LE performance package awakes an even mightier beast, with the package adding even wider and stickier tires, adjustable camber plates at each corner, and Multimatic's dynamic suspension spool valve dampers. Think of the Camaro ZL1 as a NASCAR Cup Series racer for the street. Number 5. Porsche 911. If you close your eyes and picture a Porsche, it's likely that the 911 renders first in your imagination. This rear-engined fastback is a legend, and for good reason. Make that many reasons. For decades it has been a benchmark for performance and handling and feel, inspiring rivals such as the Aston Martin Vantage, the Audi R8, and the Maserati MC20, to name a few. The standard 911 sticks to its roots with a set of twin-turbo flat-six engines that have been tuned for up to 473 horsepower. Higher performance turbo and GT3 models are available, this is Porsche, of course, but we review those cars separately. Most 911 models have rear-wheel drive, but all-wheel drive is available. Coupe, cabriolet convertible, and Targa body styles are offered, and they have a cabin that is comfortable for two adults, whether it's been decked out in luxuries or left bone stock. The 911 superiority stems not only from its lofty performance capabilities, but also from the fact that it's comfortable enough to live with on a daily basis. Number 4. Jaguar F-Type. The 2024 Jaguar F-Type is the pretty face of the sports car segment, but it doesn't hold back on performance. Its supercharged V8 sings a sexy melody and its handling is plenty good enough to entertain enthusiast drivers, though it's softer around the edges than the best of its rivals, the Chevrolet Corvette or the Porsche 718 Cayman. Its cabin is snug and lined with quality materials, but its design and features haven't been updated in a while. Convertible models come with a power-operated soft top that tucks neatly in the trunk, top-down it's gorgeous, but the coupe is beautiful too, and its additional cargo space is more practical. Either way, the F-Type is one of the best-looking sports cars, handsome enough to dress up any driveway and aggressive enough to make driving a joy. Number 3. McLaren Artura McLaren embraces a hybridized future of high performance with the sculptural 2023 Artura supercar. The newly introduced mid-engine two-seater rides on a new lightweight platform. It also pairs a twin-turbo V6, the company's first, with a battery electric powertrain to create a plug-in hybrid model, another first. The duo generates a combined 671 horsepower and 531 pound-feet of torque. Performance estimates are highlighted by a 0 to 60 mph time of 2.6 seconds and a top speed of 205 miles per hour. Its bodywork is pure McLaren, complete with prominent air vents and scissor-style doors. Along with a more premium and spacious interior than the 720S, the 2023 Artura offers several convenience and driver assistance features.
Number 2. Audi R8. Few supercars actually get driven daily, but the 2023 Audi R8 seems designed for such a task. It offers a reasonably easy-going ride along with its breakneck acceleration. The R8 shares its underpinnings and its powertrain, a mighty V10 and 7-speed automatic, with the wild Lamborghini Huracan. The Audi is less hardcore than the Lumbo, though, less intense on a twisty road or racetrack. What the R8 offers instead is a level of refinement that's more in line with the rest of the Audi lineup. It's snug. Two-seat cabin is lined with high-end materials and features a minimalist design that forgoes the usual center-mounted infotainment display in favor of a digital gauge display that serves both purposes. The interior is comfortable for both driver and passenger, and the R8 would make a fine touring car if it weren't for a puny cargo area that fits only one carry-on suitcase. If this particular cross-section of performance and luxury appeals to you, now's the time to act, as this is the final year for Audi's V10-powered showpiece. Number 1. Chevrolet Corvette Z06 The 2023 Chevy Corvette Z06 elevates the iconic nameplate into territory occupied by exotics from Ferrari and Lamborghini. With the engine now located behind the driver, it looks unlike any Z06 seen before. Not only is it considerably wider than the regular Corvette Stingray, but it also boasts bigger air intakes and a unique rear wing. Thanks to a flat-plane crankshaft, the new Z06, naturally aspirated 5.5-liter V8 doesn't sound like any vet that's come before, and it blasted the car to 60 miles per hour in just 2.6 seconds at our test track. While it inherits the best amenities and technology from the Stingray, its performance and handling have been heightened and sharpened. Chevy switched to a mid-engine layout to make the C8 Corvette a supercar that more folks can afford, and the 2023 Corvette Z06 promises to embarrass more than a few people driving insanely expensive supercars when they meet at a racetrack.